What's up guys, Little Rex here for Synergy 1.6.2 video update. If you're new to Synergy, you're looking for a virtual KVM, uh, which is a keyboard, video, and mouse sharing program, where that way you don't have to need hardware to do it, like to configure multiple computers together. This is definitely one of the pieces of software you want to be looking at. It's an incredible piece of software, and a lot has been done to it since version 1.5.0. Right now, 1.6.2, they've added a bunch of new features with the ability to pass programs or files back and forth between the computers. There are a little few technical issues with that that will be handled in a separate video. But there's also hotkey sharing, uh, screen locking. There's a lot of different features with this program. It's it's workable with Mac in Ubuntu, in Linux, and Fedora. So. It's really a robust piece of software, and the guys at Synergy Project have done an amazing job with it. So much so that I am making this video because I feel it is such a good piece of software. So first you want to go to SynergyProject.org, you'll do Get Started with Synergy, you'll probably do a single user license if you're watching this video. You'll type in your full name and your email address, and the reason, and now it's $10, when I made the 1.5.0 video, that was where they had first started charging for it, and I believe it was $5. Then they experimented with a $20 price tag, and they found that the happy median was about $10. And I feel it's a good price, especially for a software of this quality. And I'm very happy with it. I think the price tag is reasonable. You know, you spend $10 on a lot of pieces, different pieces of software. You'll probably spend more than that. So, you know, $10 is very, very affordable. So you pay the $10, you click purchase. I already have it, so I just go to log in and we just my password manager auto fills all the stuff in for me and then you go to download synergy and you'll just right click you can get you know the windows version the mac version the dbn or ubuntu linux version red hat and fedora and you can even get the source code so you know it's they give you all the options that you have i already have it so we're not gonna bother downloading it again I assume if you're watching this video, you know how to download the program, but here we go. So you go to Synergy once it's installed and you'll see this screen here, okay? And this is on the server side. Now the server is the computer that's gonna be sharing the keyboard and mouse functions. So you're gonna be using its keyboard, its mouse to pass to the other computers. So you'll use this IP address and there is an auto config option here that we're gonna touch on when we talk about the client side. Now you want to go to configure and you'll drag a PC down and in this case I the PC I'm sharing is to even though it's to my right I pass the mouse to the left because of the three monitors I have to the right. So we do that and what you want to do is you want to go and you want to get the full PC name. In this case all my PCs are named after space things. So you'll see here as you go to my computer right click go down to properties. The you'll grab the full computer name here. Now, with the Macintosh or Apple versions of the software, you have to add a .local uh, amendment to it. Uh, I, I'm not a Mac person. I am going to be putting a video out for Mac with the help of the Synergy team. So we will be touching on that. But as for PC and Windows, just grab the full computer name. This In this case, it's PC Mirror. And then you just put that in here, screen name Sputnik, and close it, and close it. And then you click st Apply. That's it. And then it says stop server and it'll restart Synergy for you. Okay, let's talk about the client side now. So once you've downloaded Synergy 1.6.2, it's the same file, there's no difference. Click run, you click next, and it's just a very basic install, except the license terms. Very basic stuff. Path, if you want to change the path, you can, but normally most people don't. It's a pretty small program as it is. The program will install itself. And once you do that, then you will click finished. And then you go to start menu, since there's no desktop icon, type in Synergy in the program files here. And we load up Synergy, there you go. Now you wanna click the client side box and click auto config. Once you click auto config, it's gonna say install Bonjour. And Bonjour is a broadcasting program that will auto detect the IP address being put out by the server. And it'll auto infill all the data that you need. Now, if worst comes to worst, you can always input the server IP on its own, but the auto config is very stable and you want to do it. So you click auto config, click apply, it'll fill in all the relevant information you need. You'll get this thing saying Synergy is running, watchdog status, okay. And then you can start passing the mouse back and forth. Of course, you're going to need to allow access, 
to it if it's your first time on Windows. So you just click allow access and there you go. Now once you, the mouse is passing back and forth, you'll see like entering screen, leaving screen, and you'll see it on both Synergy uh, modules. And the good thing is too, you can just close Synergy, so just, clap, just click that X and just collapse it down to the task manager versus having to keep it on the bar. Okay, so that is Synergy, how to set up the very basic setup. Now, Synergy has had a number of updates put forth into it since version 1.5.0. You can allow file passing, you can do hotkey mapping, which has now been fixed and is great. Unfortunately, the Macintosh version for the hotkeys, I was told that there is some problem right in the source code with it that's never been able to be fixed but it is on the Synergy to-do list. Like that dev team will get it once they have somebody who they can just dedicate to that one project because it's a fairly deep problem to what was told to me. But other than that, then that is Synergy. Like I said, it's a great software. It's a great KVM, unbelievably well, well made. And I personally love it. That's why I made this video. I hope you like it. I hope you like the other videos that we put out for how to use this Synergy software to its fullest extent and maximize your $10 value. As always though, click that follow button below or the subscribe button on YouTube, the follow button on Twitch. You can see me on at Twitter slash or at Twitter LittleRex2015. And that is it guys. Please enjoy the videos, comment on the videos. I'm always happy to answer questions and I will see you next time.